Sandra Clapham, in a vision, talking about health and well-being today. International Millionaire Day, 20th of May, as far as I'm aware. So what's that about? I mean, how many people am I going to address today that are millionaires? I don't suppose many of you that are watching me will be millionaires. But are you millionaires? I was thinking about that. Well, I actually read it, but well, I may not have a million pounds. But how much is it worth having great health and having a really happy family and having lovely children and a beautiful home? I mean, all those things. So it isn't just about richness in money. And how many celebrities have we seen in local papers that have got all the money in the world and yet they you know, they kill themselves or they go on drugs or they are depressed or they're just not in a happy place. I think once, my mum once said to me that money can be the root of all evil and in a lot of places it really does corrupt people. But I have a great love of money. I think it's beautiful and wonderful and if it's respected and looked after and nurtured, it can be really utilised. Now, the things that I wanted to talk about like being a millionaire or being rich in is, you, you know, we've got nature just outside the doorstep, most of us. Even if we don't live in a particularly wonderful area where there's lots of greenery, there will be something somewhere of nature to go out and look in. And that's a great feeling when you get out inside nature. So really focusing away from the millionaire and all the money, what are the wonderful things that you and I have? whether that be lovely, happy families, like I said, or being able to get into nature or having a great, healthy body. That's what really counts. So it would be nice to be a millionaire as well and have the both, but just now I'm going to settle for the first one. <laughs>